Hi guys, um, just doing a pressure test on the <clears throat> heat exchanger which I picked up and uh, it looks pretty good, it's a nice a nice welding, welding job on that uh, it's an inlet and outlet and um, <clears throat> yeah eventually this will have um, ceramic blanket all the way around it uh, to uh, seal it off make sure the gases go through the uh, pipes um, I very stupidly didn't measure the barrel properly and uh, these these uh, tails, the uh, flow and return pipes were too long uh, for me to get the actual heat exchanger in so I just had to hack a slit in and then kind of uh, angle it in but um, I think they were 10 inches, they could have done with being uh, 8 by the look of it but, uh, and I didn't want to re-thread them so I just hacked the barrel, I patched that up, no problem that's uh, where the thermal blanket's going and uh, yeah, I'm just doing a, a pressure test with my uh, English shop bike pump this is what we used to use for pressure testing uh, heating systems in England it seemed to work quite well I'm just going to test it at uh, one and a half bar which is about uh, just over 20 pound a square inch and uh, yeah I managed to find, uh, I had, this is what I used to use in England, <coughs> but uh, this is a 22 mil pipe, it's a little bit smaller than 3 quarters, and these are some uh, English fittings, it's just a, a John Guest speed fit, it's a push fit uh, fitting, it has a, a gripper ring with teeth on it and uh, an o-ring which seals it, and uh, what I did is I just drilled a hole through the end and then glued in a um, a tyre valve off a, a bike tyre and uh, stopped, stopped off the other end and I'm uh, just using some soapy water just to uh, check for bubbles make sure it's all airtight and I'm going to leave it for a couple of hours and see if we uh, it's uh, yeah See if we get a drop in pressure while uh, I'm actually going to go get the fire bricks now. Uh, these are the hard, um, these are called uh, splits because they're uh, actually half the thickness of it. Uh, we've got a load of those, uh, but yeah, we've got some uh, fire bricks to go get now from a friend. So I'll leave that on test, and um, yeah, that's where I'm up to now. Hopefully. It'll hold pressure, if not, I'm going to have to pull it out and uh, find out where the <coughs> if there's any uh, problems with the weld. The guy that welded me this up, he said he did fill it up with some water and uh, he had a few little leaks, but I think that's probably one of them there. But um, he said he, think, he thinks he got them all and um, I'm not sure much, how much pressure he had in it, but... Uh, it's holding at the moment, which is good. Okay, guys, that's an update for now. I'll uh, I'll show you my booty once I've picked it up. All my uh, bricks that I've got on the uh, thermal blanket and the thermal board. Okay, this is my chef signing out for now. Bye.